Patriot Prime Reviews is a channel for adult collectors and may not be suitable for children under 13 years of age. Viewer discretion is advised. Hey, what's going on guys? Patriot Prime here once again with another ToyHacks.com sponsored review. But before I get started, I need you guys to do me a favor. If you're watching this video right here and are not a subscriber of Patriot Prime Reviews, please consider hitting that subscribe button right now. It won't cost you a thing, but will help me and my channel out tremendously. Now, on to the decals. And the set we're looking at in this video is for War for Cybertron Earthrise Barricade. And this decal set includes three decal sheets, two on vinyl backing, and one on foil. So now, without further ado, let's take a look at Barricade, both before and after Toy Hacks decals. And welcome to Patriot Prime Reviews. <laughs> In robot mode, straight out of the packaging, Barricade looks great, aside from his clear shins right there, and he's a far cry from his hot pink Generation 1 self. Barricade here is probably my favorite addition to the Transformer franchise, thanks to the Bayverse films. Now, taking a closer look at Barricade, he's got some fantastic paint applications there on the head sculpt with the purple crest the red eyes, and the gold face. I just really think that pops. He also has a white Decepticon insignia right there on top of the chest, and on the door wings, white paint applications with police, and the police badge and star. And that's pretty much it for paint applications and details on Barricade. The rest is just molded in. So there you go, guys. There's one final look at Barricade in robot mode before and after. Barricade gets quite a few new decals to help enhance his robot mode. Taking a closer look at the figure, you get new decals right there for the crest and new decals for the shoulders. Now you do have options. You have black like I used or you have purple. I decided to go with black because I think it just blends in more with the rest of the toy. You also get new little red decals right there. New decals here for the door wings. On the chest, he gets a brand new chrome grill. Signal lights, a 643 right there on the side. Side of the arm, purple decals. Down here on the waist, you get a purple and yellow decal. Once again, you do have options. You have a CHC decal that Prowl had, but I decided Barricade needed that one. Down on the waist piece, you got new purple decals here and here, and a new decal there for that little indentation triangle. Moving on down to the legs, the clear plastic gets covered up with window decals. Along the feet, you get brake decals and a vanity license plate. Inside the leg, you get new decals right there on both sides, and new decal right there in that indentation. So all in all, a fantastic look for Barricade. But you think robot mode looks great? Wait till you see him in vehicle mode. So there you have Barricade in robot mode after. In vehicle mode, straight out of the packaging, Barricade still looks really good, aside from a couple of issues. One being this purple wheel clip that just stands out like a sore thumb. I don't mind the wheel clip there on the back because it's black and blends in with the wheel, but this one up front sucks. I do not like that. Also, not a big fan of the clear windows that you can look through and see all of the robot junk. But other than that, he looks really good. I do like the two-tone look here on the front between the hood and the rest of the vehicle. You got the white Decepticon insignia right there. Lots of great molded details. I like the clear headlights. You got the paint applications there on the doors once again with the white police and the badge. He has the addition of the light bar there on top. Back of the vehicle, lots of molded details, but no paint applications. So there you go, guys. There you have Barricade in vehicle mode before. And real quick, just for laughs, G1 Barricade. And after, and I'm going to say this right out the gate, 
This by far is my favorite Toy Hacks decal set for an alt mode so far this year. They have totally changed the looks of Earthrise Barricade. Now let's start here with the front of the vehicle. He gets a brand new grill right there, all done up in chrome. He gets signal lights, a 643 right there on the hood. He gets these new vent decals right there, along with the police Decepticon shield. You can also see he's got brand new window decals that go all the way around that hide all of that translucent plastic that showed the robot, robot junk underneath. And I love the two-tone look with the silver that blends into the purple. That just looks amazing. On the doors, you get a huge new decal that makes the door completely white with a nice two-tone police logo right there with the Decepticon shield once again. Also get a 643 down here on the bottom. Along the side here, you have barricades trademarked to punish and enslave. A 643 right up here behind the light bar. Police on the spoiler. On the back of the vehicle, you've got the third brake light, tail lights all the way around, a vanity plate that says punish. There's also one that says police. And you've got 911 here on the side with the little symbol of a telephone. Does everybody remember what one of those looks like? This is an amazing set. I can't get over how much I like the looks of Barricade now. Toy Hacks, you knocked this one out of the park. So there you go, guys. One final look at Barricade in vehicle mode after. I also want to point out real quick that Barricade gets side mirror decals. I mean, check that out. Chrome decals that have a great reflection to them. I have no idea why I keep forgetting to show those. I totally forgot to show them in the Prowl decal video as well. Toy Hacks came out of the gate swinging with this decal set for Earthrise Barricade. They change up the look of this toy so much, especially in vehicle mode. I can't rave enough about Barricade's new look in vehicle mode. It just totally blows my mind. I think I'm going to actually display this Barricade in vehicle mode next to the Siege Barricade in robot mode. Like I said, Toy Hacks knocked it out of the park with this decal set, and I couldn't be happier. Now guys, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, don't forget to subscribe, and don't forget to click that bell icon to get notified when I upload new reviews. Once again, this is Patriot Prime, signing out. Hoo-ah!